Welcome back to Unwrapped, where we're starting a fire in our mouth with a taste of atomic foods. Now, it's common to find the hot stuff in sauces and salsas, but what about in an unsuspecting potato chip? Check out what it takes to become America's hottest chip. Blair Lazar is a man comfortable with handling the heat. Since 1989, he's been the chief chili head of Blair's Sauces and Snacks and has a place in the Guinness Book of World Records as the creator of the hottest products on Earth. We make food for an extreme world that we live in. At times, some of my products, yeah, they're, you know, similar to tongue piercing, and at times they're similar to just just fantastic experiences of all your senses awakening. In addition to sauces and rubs, in 1999, he invented a new item, the Death Rain Habanero Chip. We use the hottest chili in the world, um, the habanero chili. We have them grown very special just for these chips. The habanero chips themselves contain ingredients that are over about 600,000 Scoville units. It's hot. It tastes like uh, sticking out your tongue and smashing it with a hammer. Daunting praise for a snack. Yet today, Blair's produces more than one million bags of chips a month. The process begins with a tractor trailer dumping its load of Dakota peeled potatoes into the factory. We're bringing in um, anywhere from two to three full tractor trailers each and every week for the death rain. The first stop for the potatoes is into a hopper, which begins the cleaning process by shaking the initial layer of dirt off tons of tubers. Next, potatoes make their way to a holding tank via a water transport system, and then pass into a polisher, where the spuds are skinned and sent to meet their destiny. So now they go in, they're on these conveyors, and they're shooting down and straight right through, boom. They go right into the slicer, boom, 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 boom. Fills right into our, uh, our oil. A mixer then circulates the chips in canola oil for nearly 12 minutes. After inspection, chips move onto the spicer where they are doused with death rain rub. Death rain is a blend of primarily habaneros, but we use a lot of different other seasonings to balance it out and give it, aside from that, you know, boom, punch, you get that fantastic flavor that goes with it. Finally, chips are bagged and boxed and ready to be shipped out. And they even come with a promise from the man behind the heat. These are the hottest, most flavorful potato chips on planet Earth, and you guarantee you will feel alive. A popular game with Blair's chips is chip roulette. At a party, mild flavored chips are put into a bowl with just a few habanero chips thrown in, which would have absolutely no effect on the person in our next story because when you are 